Welcome to Minecraft with our custom realms. In today's video, we're going to be entering brand new portals to enter custom dimensions that might be a little too overpowered. I'm talking new realms ranging from dirt, TNT, and even diamond to even some new secret ones near the end you'll have to see for yourself. Can it be the dragon? Where does this portal take me to? Stay tuned to find out. And a lot of you guys watching are new and not subscribed. So if you do enjoy the content, feel free to subscribe with me in three, two, one. There we go. Welcome to the team. And for today, let's see if we can hit the light goal without looking at our screen. Ready? Three, two, one. Go ahead and try it. Were you able to do it? Anyways, guys, enjoy the video. So we're going to be starting today in the normal Minecraft dimension. Everything around us completely normal. We got the savannah right here. We got a desert to our left and I think a village actually up there. Oh yeah. Okay. There's a village literally right beside me, but I'm not going to be staying here for too long because as you saw from the title, today's Minecraft challenge involves us going to multiple new dimensions. That includes TNT, coal, diamond, literally any block in the game. So if I go into my inventory real quick, we have these things called an empty portal activator. So for example, I can put one empty portal activator right there and one dirt and then we get a dirt portal activator so yet again that probably doesn't make any sense just yet but you guys will see very soon what i mean when i say i can make any portal in the game out of any block in the game so real quick i'm gonna make a new portal and just like that we now have a full-on right click dirt dimension portal and you already know i'm going inside right away and once we go inside we enter a literal dirt dimension what the heck <laughs> Well, there's actually like nothing here. It's kind of, oh, wait, is that weather skeletons? Okay, it seems like the dirt dimension is pretty empty. There's water. There's, I think that's gravel and TNT. Oh gosh. I kind of just want to showcase that there's new dimensions, but this place is kind of useless. So let's go figure out a better dimension. The dirt dimension, not the best dimension. All right, well, dirt portal activator, don't need you anymore. We have 15 more portals, so I got to be a bit smart with the next ones. I'm thinking about it right now and we could probably do, oh, wait, a desert temple. Oh, okay. I wasn't talking about that, but we could probably do a diamond dimension, a gold dimension. There are so many possibilities right now for these portals. So low key. Wait, what if I make a wheat dimension? I do need food. Wait, no, I messed up. That's not how you make wheat bells. Oh my goodness. I'm actually so dumb. <laughs> I just wasted so many hay bells. That, oh, okay, that's actually a no, guys. All right, we're not going to talk about that. Low key, I could go into a bookshelf dimension. That would help a lot with getting XP or maybe even enchanted books. I don't really know how the dimensions work besides the dirt dimension. And as you saw, the dirt dimension was actually pretty useless. Oh, wait a second, guys. I have an idea. I do need some more wood. So what if I go ahead and make a wood dimension? All right, before I go to that temple, I think we should go ahead and go to the wood dimension. I'm going to waste another activator with this. But with this, we should be good to go with an oak log portal activator. And and why not? We're not going to get wood through trees. We're going to go into the oak dimension. So inside the oak dimension, we have an insane amount of oak. What the heck? Okay, there's wither skeletons again. I don't want to mess with those. Literally, I have one life. Let's go ahead and just get a lot of wood and get out of here. I don't know why I didn't just chop down trees, but you know what? It's a cool dimension. We got TNT. We got oak. And we also have some nice planks. Not bad. Literally, there's so many portals we can make. I could make a cobblestone portal, another dirt portal, a door portal. Wait, could we make a door portal? Wait, what about a chest portal? There are way too many portals we can make. I already have my book, so I might make a bookshelf portal coming soon, but the main thing I'm going to be going for, guys, is the iron portal, gold portal, diamond portal, and if we do have enough time, I might even go for a netherite portal, which I feel like would be a bit too difficult to make because obviously we're going to be needing 10 netherite blocks, and I don't think I have enough time to get all that netherite. I should go ahead and make a TNT portal, guys. I could use a TNT for mining. That'd be really useful. And some bones. All right, we got some string and uh, golden apple. Nice. I wish I could make a golden apple portal, but that's not a block, so, you know, we kind of have to ignore that. Bug, please be good. Really? 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 Curse of binding. Really? Oh, which is even laughing at me. What the heck? <gasps> that could be good. Actually, the dimensions have ocean, so we could try fishing in a new dimension. Wait a second. I'm going to go ahead and grab these chests to go ahead and make a chest portal. I feel like a chest portal would be really cool. <gasps> no, 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 no. Please, please, please. I literally just started this challenge. No, none of that. I am getting out of here. <laughs> Holy, what is he doing in there? Okay, we need one more TNT and then I could go into the TNT portal. But once I'm done getting the TNT, I definitely need to go down mining, get some iron, get some diamonds and go ahead and get very stacked so I can kill this dragon. Oh, wait, I didn't even see this. There's another book area. Low key, this might be actually enough to make a whole bookshelf portal. Holy, that is a lot of bookshelves. Okay, so we have the oak log portal activator, which I don't think we need anymore. We still have 14 portal activators, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and make a literal bookshelf portal activator. We're gonna be going into the bookshelf dimension, which I don't know really what to 
expect from this dimension, but I'm gonna assume that it's gonna be probably a lot of books. So, uh, definitely a lot of reading in here. All right, we got the bookshelf portal. It's time. Okay, let's hope it's nothing bad. Oh, and we are in, and holy, this looks so cool. What the heck? All right, so yet again, we have a lot of TNT. I don't know why there's so much TNT in these portals, but we can actually make a TNT portal now. So, I'm gonna go ahead and grab all the TNT I can. It's a literally a giant library, and there's a lot of weather skeletons still. Okay, I wanna stay away from those. All right, let's get some books real quick, and then I'm going back. So, after a minute of getting books, we have two stacks of books already. This dimension was definitely the right call. All right, I'm gonna do this just for science, but what if we go into the TNT dimension right now and it somehow blows up? I don't want that to happen. All right, we got the TNT portal activator. I don't know if I wanna go in here just yet, but let's go ahead and make the portal and I'm just hoping for the best right now. All right, let's do this. Holy, that is a lot of TNT. Okay, I am not blowing up this dimension. There's coal down here. Wait, what? I guess I'll go ahead and get some coal. Why not? But what the heck? Holy TNT. Okay, if anything blows up in here, like if I don't know if gas spawn or something, but literally if anything spawns here, I am actually dead. All right, so I don't really know what I'm gonna do with this much TNT, but I'm gonna get it either way. Right, so I may have gone a bit too much TNT. We're gonna probably be using this against the dragon. I feel like I could kill the dragon on one blow up. Oh gosh, no, 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 no. Please, 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 please. I don't know why wither skeletons are in here, but you know what? We're getting out and I'm gonna go mine some iron so I can get an iron block portal. But now that we've done all that, let's actually go caving, get some iron, get some diamonds, and actually get into either a diamond or netherite portal because I feel like those portals are probably going to be very worth it and maybe very overpowered. Wait, hold on. To make a diamond portal, that's a lot of diamonds. That is going to be like 9 times 10 diamonds. That's 90 diamonds we need. What? Oh, man. We have 12 portal activators left, so I should probably be smart with these. Go ahead and let me know in the comments down below what your favorite portal from this video is because uh, I think the TNT one might be my favorite one so far. I just realized we only need 10 iron ore because I could just go ahead and make an iron ore portal. Okay, I'm going to cook this iron just for now because I do need some tools, but this is actually a really good cave. Any diamonds down here? Oh, some lapis and actually diamonds right away. Holy, we just got into this cave. It doesn't look like that big of a vein, but low key, I wish I had a silk touch pickaxe because then I could mine all these diamond ores completely, but I do need a lot of diamonds either way. So maybe I could also find a dimension that gives us netherite. Oh, wait, that's the nether. Never mind. <laughs> All right, just in case, I'm gonna go ahead and make some tools because I feel like the wither skeletons are definitely dangerous in there. Got our water bucket. We did get enough iron ore, so I think it's time, guys. Let's go ahead and go into the iron dimension. Sooner or later, we'll go into the actual, you know, normal dimensions, aka the nether and the end. But for now, I think this might be the easiest way to actually get a ton of iron ore. So uh, maybe there's gonna be more stuff in here. Let's check it out. We're inside and there is lava in here. Okay, interesting. I did not expect... Oh, <gasps> iron blocks. Okay. Oh, no, but there's so many wither skeletons. Oh, gosh, I might have to make a run for it. I'm doing it. How's it going, guys? Please don't chase me. Please don't. Ch they're chasing me. Okay, this is bad. If I die once, the whole video is over. I can't be having that before I get the diamond dimension. Okay, we're good. We're good. Never mind. There's more. <gasps> Iron blocks right over there. Okay. Oh gosh, I might have to fight this guy. Okay, I'm gonna fight this guy. Be careful, Nestor. One, two. Oh gosh, that's the first mob I killed all game. Nice. Oh my gosh, look at all the iron blocks. Okay, before I do anything, I'm gonna go ahead and get all the iron I can. All right, and just like that, we can finally make full iron. Holy. And one other thing I definitely need is probably a shield. Yeah, that's probably the smart thing to do. I mean, why not? Might as well also make an anvil. There we go. And if we need more iron, it's all good because we're going to be going straight into this iron block dimension. Empty portal activator, block of iron, iron block portal activator. Such a weird challenge. Such a weird dimension. Oh, hello. What are you doing, buddy? What, what is he doing? Okay. All right. You know what? You stay there and live your best life. I'm going to go into an iron block dimension. Have a great day. And just like that, we are inside the iron block dimension, which honestly doesn't have much going for it besides like, I guess, some lava and a lot of iron blocks. Might as well mine some iron blocks, but I think I might just be getting out of here very soon. All right, so, so far we've gone through six dimensions and wait, I'm back on the surface. All right, so we're back where we were before. I need to collect those diamonds before I do anything else though. Let's go. Sadly, we don't have soak touch, so I gotta mine the diamonds the old fashioned way. Oh my goodness, it would've been so nice to actually make a portal that way. I mean, 10 diamonds isn't too bad. I'm pretty determined to get to a diamond dimension somehow. Oh, maybe a redstone dimension also. That'd be kind of cool. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Oh, and there goes that. Wait, gold. Nice. Okay, so that's a four vein of gold. We're getting actually pretty close already to a gold ore dimension, which uh, I don't think we'll need to mine any more gold once we get the gold ore dimension. And we only need two more redstone blocks and then we can actually go into the redstone dimension. Wait, is there TNT in the redstone dimension? Because that means all the TNT would actually blow up. Oh gosh, I, I don't want to break the game if I go into a redstone dimension. Oh wait, diamonds. Okay. What? No, 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 no. I didn't even see those. No, no, no. Okay. That was a bit too close. I'm one step closer to the diamond dimension. I mean, we could make like one diamond block. Oh man, 
man, this is gonna take forever, guys. All right, might as well. Let's go ahead and try this redstone block dimension. I feel like this might be a really bad idea because of the TNT, but you know what? I'm gonna take the risk. Let's do it. Oh gosh, this place is kind of cool. And instead of TNT, we have a lot of lamps and I think that's quartz. That's kind of cool. Oh, there's lava too. Okay, I should probably just go back, guys. A really cool dimension, but I don't think there's anything useful in here for us. So, uh, all right, let's go back and uh, yeah, we're not going back there. All right, time to search for more diamonds. More gold right there. Nice, okay. Oh, this is way more than enough. Gold or dimension. I feel like it's gonna have gold blocks. So let's go ahead and start making this portal. All right, we got the gold portal activator. Right click and now it's time. Oh, it's kind of cool now. It's like a black portal. Interesting. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, that is a lot of gold. I don't know why I'm surprised, but honestly, all these dimensions are very, very overwhelming with the amount of blocks. And I think I was right, guys. There are definitely gold blocks in the gold dimension, but how do we get over there? They're in difficult places. Holy gold. That is so much over there. Wait, what happened to my levels? Did my levels disappear? I just went through the portal. My levels completely disappeared. Did that happen with every dimension? I don't think I should be here. Oh gosh. Okay. This is a lot more difficult than I thought. I just want some easy gold. I guess we got to fight guys. All right. Let's see if we can get one more of the skull from this. No, please don't hit me. I'm not ready for that. All right. One last one. Holy gold. There's so much gold right here. No. Oh gosh. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. It's only a little bit of water. Oh, my levels came back. Okay. That was really weird. Finally, some gold blocks. There we go. So, um, we now have 18 blocks of gold. And because why not? Because I am going into a diamond block dimension sooner or later. I think we should go ahead and make a gold block dimension and just see what's inside. Let's go ahead and make the gold block portal activator. Boom. Let's go inside. Oh gosh. Okay. Holy gold. Oh my gosh. Wait, why is there wood up here? But I'm just going to go ahead and grab all the gold I can get out and probably never come back. All right, let's go back. Okay. So we're back in, in a random random cave. Interesting. All right. I made a diamond pickaxe. This should make things a little bit quicker. I don't need any ores besides diamonds because if I do need gold and diamonds. Okay. Right. But like I was saying though, if we do need any ores, I could just go back into the portal and just go to a gold dimension or iron dimension. This cave is really nice though. Holy. All right. Next dimension we go to that actually has water. I might actually go ahead and do some fishing because that could be a way we get a good book, but the chances are probably really low. Oh, diamonds. Okay. I almost didn't see that. Nice. We actually have another diamond block. So now we have two diamond blocks out of the 10 we need, which is so many diamond blocks. It's not as hard as getting netherite, so I think it's definitely... Oh, di diamonds again. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, another diamond vein finally. Guys, I have been mining for way too long now. We now have seven diamond blocks, eight diamonds. I had to go back up. I made some golden carrots, which was actually really useful because we have so many blocks of gold and also another spawner over there. But we are getting closer now to our goal of getting 10 diamond blocks, but it's been quite the grind so far. So we only need around 28 more diamonds, and then we can finally go to the diamond dimension. It has been quite the grind, but we're almost there. So I had to waste some diamonds on a new diamond pickaxe, but we're now only one diamond and one more diamond block away from actually making the diamond block portal. And, uh, there are, uh, what? what? <laughs> okay. There's a diamond vein there and a diamond vein there. This looks like a one vein, honestly. Uh, yeah, it's just a one vein. Okay. This is like the first double vein I've found at this whole challenge. What the heck? That ends up coming out to be only seven diamonds, but wait, this might be almost enough. Guys, we have 10 diamond blocks. We're getting so close. We need three more and then we're finally done. Oh, an enderman too. Okay. I should probably be grinding. Oh, two Endermen. Three Endermen. That's perfect. Mr. Enderman, please, all of you, give me your Ender Pearls. I would be very happy with that. All right. One, two, four, five. Nice. First Ender Pearl. Not bad. We're almost there, guys. We are going to be completing this challenge, even though it is quite the grind. And just like that, we got another Ender Pearl. Two Ender Pearls. Not bad. Oh, wait. That might be the last one. Yes, it's enough. Yes. Okay, perfect. So with these 11 Diamond Blocks, I can finally go ahead and make a Diamond Block Portal Activator. And the best part, guys, I should probably do this in a safe spot so I don't lose it. But you know what? We're going to get enough diamonds once we go inside for all the diamonds we'll ever need. Oh, here we go, guys. After all that hard work, we can finally try out the diamond block dimension. Not even diamond ore, the diamond block. Let's do this. Holy diamonds. Okay, I knew there was gonna be a lot of diamonds, but either way, this is actually crazy. What the heck? I wish I could make diamond block armor. That would've been really cool to get, but it doesn't matter because just like that, guys, we have 14 diamond blocks. Who needs iron armor when you're in the diamond block dimension? All we need now is just some good old diamond armor and maybe soon enough, we'll try and go into the netherite dimension. It doesn't look like there's any netherite in here, though. I think we're done here. It was nice being here, but I finally got to go to the nether in the end. And after all this time, we finally have the diamonds to afford an enchant table. I should have probably made this earlier, but I mean, we have all the diamonds in the world now. Efficiency one, definitely needed that. Sharpness one, not bad. Power one, protection one, protection one, protection one. And finally, you guessed it, protection one, protection one. And did I say protection one? Because protection one. What if I go into the cobweb dimension? Another protection one, by the way. So with all that, we can actually go ahead and make 
cool protection to diamond armor. Definitely going to be useful in the nether and in the end. So you know what? I appreciate it. All right, time to make this portal. And finally, the ultimate dimension, guys. Something you guys have been waiting for. The nether dimension. And we're in, guys. Look at this. Completely new dimension. Not not really. It's just the nether. Let's go get some blaze rods and get out. What happens if we go into a netherite dimension? I'm going to do this real quick for science because I feel like it'd be kind of funny if we go into a netherite dimension, even though the nether is a thing. I'm going to go ahead and waste an empty portal activator on netherrack. Let's see what this is. Oh, gosh. That's just the portal noise. Watch it just take me to the nether. Oh, wow. Okay, this is kind of weird. It's literally the nether, but with TNT and a lot of wither skeletons. I don't know about this one, guys. Oh, gosh. Okay, this is kind of weird. I'm inside of dimension of netherrack, even though the nether is a thing. I think I'm just going to go back. Probably don't want to be here. Let's go back into the nether. Oh, <gasps> we found a fortress. Just got to get in and out. I already hear the blazes. First blaze right here. I have a sharpness one. This should be good work. All right, blaze spawner right here. Should not be too hard to kill them. All right, I'm going to need around six blaze rods and then I should be good. All right, that's four. I can already go ahead and make three eyes of enter. Not bad. Yeah, that should be more than enough. We're getting out of here. Wait a second. The fast way to get back might actually be just by making another portal and it might take me back to the overworld. This might be the faster idea, guys. I'm going to go ahead and make a weird nether brick dimension. I don't know if this is going to work, but you know what? Oh, wait, no, it might work. Nether brick portal activator. All right, let's do this. What the heck is this place? Oh, wow. This is actually really weird. Yeah, I'm going to get out of here. So I think if I make a portal inside of a portal, it should take me back all the way to the overworld. I'm going to be wasting one portal activator for this, but I mean, cobblestone portal. Why not? Might as well go inside. All right. And it's all cobblestone. Nice. <laughs> oh, wow. That is a lot of weather skeletons. Okay. I do not want to be here. All right. Yeah, I'm going back. Please be the overworld. And it's the overworld. Perfect. Okay. We're in the middle of a desert, but this should be perfect for nighttime when we need to fight Enderman. All right. I'm going to try to get nine more and then we should be good. First Enderman. Okay. All right. Just one Ender Pearl and that would be appreciated. Yes. Okay. All right. That should be four at least now. I don't know if I should start heading to the stronghold, but I think I'm going to just try to kill as many mobs as I can. Ooh, that is a lot of mobs. Okay. Where are the Endermen? I need to grind. Okay. This might be the last one. You might call me dumb for this, but I, all I really have left is TNT. So I'm using TNT to fight the Enderman. So far it hasn't backfired yet. And that should be our last one. No. Oh, Okay, of course that happens on the last one. Okay, let's get out of here. That was a little bit of a grind, but we did get enough ender pearls. In total, we now have 12 eyes of ender, and there are so many endermen around here. There's an enderman there, there. All right, we have to go straight that way. Not bad. In total this video, we've done 13 dimensions. So with the final end dimension, that's going to be 14. And I think I might be able to do one more dimension after the end dimension, which you guys will see in the end. Literally, in the end. <laughs> that was such a bad joke. All right, so we ran for a good bit. Where is it going to... Let's come back. Okay, if the portal needs 12 eyes of ender and one of these break before we actually get there, that is going to be so unfortunate. But it did go back, so we might be really close. I'm going to see if I can find it soon. All right, let's do one more. <gasps> I went back again. Okay, wait. It should be like right under here then. All right, guys. I think it's time. I think the stronghold might be directly under us. So I think this might be it, guys. Oh, wait. Is this it? No, no stronghold yet. I do hear some lava though. Um, <gasps> it's it. Yep, this is it, guys. Here it is. Okay, is that the portal room already? No way. Okay, I spy. Oh my gosh. I almost just died right there. Okay, we're not going to be doing that. Actually, I completely forgot about one dimension I really wanted to go into. And that's the chest dimension. We haven't gone to the chest dimension. So once I find the portal room, I think I might just go into the chest dimension last second. See what's inside. To go back, fight the dragon, win the game, and then go boom, boom, boom. <gasps> Ender Pearl. Nice. Oh, that should be it. There we go. Okay. All right. So before we go in there, I think there's a one final dimension we need to go into. But before we do that, let me actually test if this is even possible. No, it's not possible. We can't go into the chest dimension. Oh man. I was actually looking forward to that. All right. I guess the chests are a scam. Well, with all that being done, guys, I think it's finally time to fight the dragon. We do have one more dimension to go to after the end. And you guys will see that once we go into one second to last dimension, the end dimension. Okay. I think I have everything. I didn't get out apples? No. Oh, and I didn't get arrows. What have I been doing? No. You know what? We have a lot of TNT. We can go back into the TNT dimension if we need to. Let's do this. Oh gosh. Okay. We're in. Okay. I know I'm supposed to be fighting the dragon guys, but I have a little bit of an idea. I think we don't have enough TNT. So I think we might be going to the TNT dimension real quick and it won't be the last time we go into the TNT dimension. The dragon was literally coming straight at me. Okay. How's it going TNT dimension? I'm back. I just need to borrow some more TNT. That is a lot of TNT. I love it. Let's go back. I think we're now ready, guys. We got all the TNT we need, and I can also stack up to these places now. All right, let's do this. Wait, is this a bad idea? Oh, oh it's a bad idea. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're gonna use a different block. Don't use TNT to try to break end crystals. Not a good idea. Final crystal, final pillar, and then we can finally start trying to get the TNT explosion on this dragon. I'm gonna be a little bit bougie with this. 
Use a diamond block. There we go. And that should be it. Okay, so that should be all the crystals. Okay, let's enter pull down. Oh gosh, okay. This is for all the marbles, guys. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay, I don't know if this is smart, guys. I really don't know if this is smart. Okay, please, please work. Please work. No! You're a cheat! What the heck was that, dragon? Oh, no. That's a lot of Enderman. Okay, we might be taking a break from that dimension. No, 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 no. I'll be back, dragon. I'm gonna go get some food real quick. All right, so I got some more stuff. I think we're ready now to do a round two with the dragon. I did not have food. All right, here we go, guys. I'm just gonna place as much TNT as I can. If the dragon comes, this should hopefully be enough to, um... Oh, wait, it came, it came, okay, okay. Oh, no, I broke half the TNT. All right, let's do this. Please work, please work. TNT, go. It's not enough, but it might do a good bit of damage. That actually did a good bit, not bad. I'm not sure if this is gonna work. Oh, it's back, it's back, it's back. I need you to stay there. I have a lot of TNT for you. Here we go, guys, fire in the hole. Go, 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 go. Yes, yes, that did so much damage. Okay, one or two more TNT runs to go, and I think that should be enough to kill the dragon. All right, let's see where he lands. All right, okay, 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 okay. Light that, and run, 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 run. Go, 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 TNT, do your thing, please. Oh, no, it's so close. One more TNT, guys, and that should be it. Oh, it's back down. This is it. Put all the TNT real quick. Light it up, and I think this should be it, guys. That is gonna be it for Minecraft, but you can build a portal out of any block, and there we go. Oh, my goodness, that was a grind. Let's get this dragon egg, and I have one more dimension to show you guys. And no, it's not gonna be a dragon egg dimension, but you know what? Let's do that real quick. Grab the egg, and we are done there. Oh, my goodness, that was a grind with the TNT. For the final dimension, let's try to go to the end stone dimension inside of the end dimension. This is probably useless, but you know what? I think we might as well try it real quick. Let's go. Oh, wow. Oh, wait, there's like end city structures. Interesting. Actually a pretty cool dimension. Anyways, let's actually go beat the game. I don't know why the end dragon thing is still on my screen. By the way, guys, hope you guys all enjoyed. Have a great one. And here's a video just like this one. Bye, guys.